We're going to be looking at some turnkey properties to go along with all the burrs you guys have got going on. Kale and Dave, this is your video. Let's dive in. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry world. Hey, real estate investors, welcome to another episode of the MLS Search and Analysis Show here on Holton Wise TV. As always, I'm your host, James Wise. And folks, this is the show where we work together, mano e mano, and I build you guys rental portfolios. And the two dudes that I'm building a big old portfolio with right now, specifically, are my guys Dave and Kale. You guys are my oil and gas engineer co-workers. You guys are teaming up, building a big-ass portfolio up here in Cleveland. You guys are down there in Texas. And we got a lot of burrs, right? We got a lot of burrs do uh, we're doing right now, right? We're looking at stuff that, uh, you know, we're forcing some uh, appreciation. We're buying cash. You guys are flush with cash. We're going in. We're buying stuff cash. We're planning on doing some big old renos, and uh, we're increasing the value. Numbers are looking good. But you guys said, hey, man, for this next video, let's find something that we don't got to mess with. Let's find something that's turnkey, more or less. Uh, let's try to hit the similar type numbers. Um, but let's see what we could do, right? And that makes sense. That's perfect, guys, because, you know, while all those burrs are happening and renovations are going down, that's just like a bunch of your money coming into Cleveland, right? We ain't going to be sending you guys any money back, right? Uh, it's going to be a while for us to get all those rentals done. I mean, we got a lot of big projects going. So as your business is, uh, you know, moving along, dude, let's balance that out. So I like it. That was smart, right? And uh, the first property I found for you guys. 2141 West 105th Cleveland 44102. Uh, it's listed at 49,500. They originally listed it at 55k. Listing is a company called Remax, right? I'm sure everyone's familiar with Remax. It's a nationwide company, right? So within the last seven days, they started at 55. I'm assuming nobody paid any attention to them. That's why they dropped it so quickly. Uh, now we're at 49.5. And dude, this, uh, this is a nice little property, man. Uh, if you guys are looking for just low issues, like we'll just get in there, pop a tenant in there, call it a day. That's that's what we got here, right? It's a two-bed, one-bath house. And, dude, it's fresh. It's clean, man. Uh, I would have liked uh, them to go in with agreeable gray. I think uh, the the cream, the cream look here, It's uh, this is like five years ago. But, hey, man, that's cool. It'll still work. Uh, we don't need to plan on doing a renovation. I mean, for this neighborhood, it's not exactly... Uh, what I would have done, but it's probably one of the nicer homes in this particular neighborhood. Now, I'm not saying this is like 100%, 100% turnkey, but like, you know, main cosmetics taken care of, bigger ticket items taken care of. Like, dude, boom, look at that. Uh, updated electrical, looking fly, nice clean basement. That furnace, that's a newer looking furnace. That hot water tank, that's newer looking, right? So, you know, more or less, I don't anticipate you guys spending much money uh, for us to get tenants in here. Now, of course, Holton Wise, we're going to, well, a couple things, right? Before you guys close, your home inspector is going to go in there and uh, your home inspector is going to see what's going on, number one. Number two, the Holton Wise is going to do our, you know, we're going to get in there. Our team's going to get in there. They're going to check everything out, make sure this home meets our minimum rental standards. So you guys might spend a few hundred or a couple grand on random stuff I don't know, but more or less, no rehab needed. Big ticket items taken care of. Let's see what the agent said because, uh, dude, there's just a lot of goodnesses up in here, man. I, I, I dig this property for you guys. Completely turnkey, fresh and clean, light and bright. Everything's done. Why rent when you could move right in better yet if you're an investor wanting great cash flow check this out you'll appreciate in 2020 all new roof furnace h2o laminate floor countertop and kitchen a laminate floor and dining room and fresh carpet throughout bath floor tile shower tile and toilet front porch door and hardware freshly painted throughout Downspot has been replaced with PVC, range and refrigerator in 2012, fence 2008, new windows, kitchen cabinets, whole house, rewiring in 2007, average sewer water is 50 and 40 a month. Hurry won't last long. So everything is looking fly. Now, here is a minor downside though, right? 
it's a two bedroom home versus a three bedroom home, so our rent's gonna be a little lower than what you're used to, right? So eight fifty is probably what we're gonna bring in, so ten thousand two hundred a year. We gotta go section eight, dudes. We got to do it, man. That is uh is paramount, right? Nice property. We've been hitting up the Metro Health area. That's a D class area, as is this. This is a little further, you know, we're kind of far west, right? Right, you know, like Metro Health, uh, that's on West 25th. We're 75, what is that, 80 streets away, right? We're 80 streets away. So, you know, the impact of that Metro Health billion dollars is probably going to go down. We still got the D-class risks here. Uh, but, you know, that's one of the sacrifices you guys got to make if you're looking for something that's already, like, done for you. Um, and you want to, like, hit similar numbers, right? So I don't, uh, you know, necessarily think that it would make any sense to do this investment if you're not down for section eight we go section eight you know more or less it can be relatively stable but uh you know you got to know this is definitely a d-class property and with the fact that it's only two bedrooms we're going to get 850 in rent so 10,200 what that's going to look like though 850 comes in 400 on average should go out and the cool thing too is like the capital expenditures that we are calculating for every property the 42 a month you know just looking at this pragmatically, dudes, you guys are going to be stacking that cash for many years, right? Because the roof, house like this, is probably like a five, maybe four or five thousand dollar roof. Well, it's already been done for us right now, so you don't have to worry about a roof for another 30 years. Furnace, 3Gs, they last 30 years. Hot water tanks, they last about 15 years, right? All new electrical, you don't have to worry about that. They got windows in there, right? So, you know, this thing's probably going to be pretty damn easy to get Section 8 approved with pretty much no money into it. So, you know, we go Section 8. We're going to eliminate the major issues. Uh, well, not eliminate, but we're going to reduce the major issues of a neighborhood like this, which is vacancy, right? People, you know, they stop paying rent. We got to evict them. That's going to cost money. Turnover is going to cost money. The property being empty is going to cost money. Then criminals, they come in, they break in the property. That costs you guys money. So we go Section 8. You know, that's going to alleviate some of that stuff. So with Section 8 in mind, I anticipate spending approximately 400 a month on average, leaving you guys with an NOI of 450 Haven't talked about price yet. Because it's only a two-bedroom... And just because of the comps of the neighborhood, I still think 49500 is going to be too much money. Yes, it's a banging house. It's a nice house, but comps are important. So I would like to pick this up for you guys at $40,000. Pick it up at 40 Gs. Unlike all your burrs, man, we don't need to come in cash. Let's do Let's finance it right off the rip, right? So you guys only put down 10. We'll get the other uh, 30 Gs financed by the bank. And after everything's all said and done, all the dust settles, that should be a 38% cash on cash return. Now, that's average. You know, some years or months are going to be better than others. Uh, know that this is a D-class investment. So, um, you know, bad shit's going to happen every now and again, right? You got you to gotta know that. But you guys are building up a big portfolio. So while other things are performing and this goes through a period of non-performance, you know, it should, it should balance out. These are the numbers I anticipate you getting. I think it's a smart play for what we're doing right now. Because it's going to be very quick and easy for us to grab a tenant in there. But, dudes, we got to go Section 8. Definitely Section 8. Everybody else out there watching this show right now, I want you to hop on to HoltonWise.com. Not a lot of property managers are going to deal with Section 8, okay? We do. Go to our FAC. We have a whole Section 8 FAC right here. We break down the whole shebang working with section eight right not a lot of pms are going to do this for y'all right because section eight it's a pain in the ass dealing with them okay it's not that the tenants are any worse but dealing with the city or not the city rather dealing with the housing authority that runs the program man it's a it's a bureaucratic nightmare it feels like dealing with the city government right you know you got one question you ask five employees you're gonna get five different answers man the whole thing, it's a pain in the ass, it's a mess. So we got a few extra little charges that are going to come in play uh, for us to go through all that stuff for you. Uh, you know, some setup fees, things of that nature. But with an investment like this, man, this is what you have to do. You're crazy if you try not to do that. Because then you're just dealing with cash paying tenants and you're in a higher risk neighborhood. So uh, it's going to be very hard to consistently hit, you know, metrics similar to what I've explained to you if you're going that route. Because... You're just going to run into just issues upon issues, right? With the Section 8 program, 
you're taking the biggest issue, which is rent not coming in consistently, and you're nipping that. You're taking care of that, getting rid of that, nipping that in the butt there. Because then you don't have to worry about things that come downstream from that, like vandalism costs after the property sits empty and criminals break in and they steal things, uh, or just the constant rehabs you got to do to turn these properties over. So... With all that said, I still think it's going to be a solid deal for you guys. I just wanted to make sure I painted the most transparent picture for you guys as humanly possible. And I wanted to specify for you that we are getting a little further west uh, from the core right next to uh, the Metro Health area. So I just wanted all that to be clear for you guys so you guys can make an appropriate buying decision. What we're going to do now, we're going to go to a word from the sponsors of today's show. Then we're going to get another property I found for you. That's going to be a fully occupied duplex. So stay tuned. U.S. Reeb is a full-service turnkey provider offering investors the opportunity to purchase single-family and multifamily investment properties in Cincinnati, Ohio, Dayton, Ohio, and Kansas City, Missouri. The purchase process is seamless. From reserving a property to obtaining financing, inspections, and insurance referrals, U.S. REAP has a dedicated team in place to manage the process from start to finish. In addition, U.S. REAP is also directly integrated with its own private placement fund for accredited investors. The fund seeks to raise $10 million to capitalize on the repositioning of distressed single-family and multifamily real estate. Discount Property Warehouse, founded by real estate visionary Robert Thiel, author of The Short-Term Retirement Program, is a complete turnkey solution for acquiring cash-flowing investment properties in Memphis, Tennessee. Our turnkey properties include a third-party home inspection, new HVAC with 10-year warranties, new dimensional roofs, competitive price-to-rent ratios, discounted property insurance, in-house property management, private financing, and much more. At Discount Property Warehouse, we have a staff of licensed agents standing by, ready to assist you with every aspect of the process. Call us today or visit us online at discountpropertywarehouse.com. All right, guys, welcome back. Now, next one I found for you guys, put on the board here. 3288 West 52nd, Cleveland 44102. Now we're at West 52nd, right? So we're approximately like 50 something streets east, closer to Metro Health, right? So that, you know, we're in that neighborhood you guys really, really like. List price 82 G's. They just listed it four days ago. Listing agent, uh, agent working out of Keller Williams. Now, this is an occupied duplex, fully occupied. First unit, two beds, one bath, 650s coming in. Second unit, two beds, one bath, 700s coming in. $1,350 a month currently coming in. That is $16,200 a year. Now, as far as the property itself, it is not, even though it is 100% occupied, okay, it is not as beautiful and freshly renovated as the one we just looked at, okay? You're not going to see like a million of those on the market right especially in these price points they only gave us exterior photos and from the outside it's not looking super fresh this photo by the way that's not the property that's a neighboring property uh, that is like new construction so they're just showing you that there's new construction development happening in the neighborhood okay that's what that is but this particular property it looks a little older a little worse for the wear it does have tenants in there they are currently paying they've actually uh, made a note in the broker notes that the tenants have paid uh, the entire time covid uh, was going down so they didn't even stop paying at that point now as for the price that is a big issue for me okay because this property is older like unlike the other one when you guys do the inspection report on that it's looking fly we had new furnace hot water tank new roof right this i assume everything is probably going to be mid to end of life so because of that i think eighty two thousand is too high now this is kind of a long shot but i believe we got to pick it up at sixty thousand dollars i think sixty thousand dollars is the right price taking into account uh, the cops in the neighborhood, where things are at, and the fact that this house, you know, it's it's turnkey in, in the in the in the way that you don't have to spend a big old uh, a bunch of rehab money right now, right off the rip to slow put some tenants in there to bring some income in. Right, the tenants are already there; they're already paying. But it is, you know, 
Roof, probably not brand new. Furnaces, hot water tank, things of that nature, right? And when these tenants do eventually turn, we're going to probably need to upgrade the kitchens and the baths, you know, make those units look particularly nice. So 60 Gs is what I think we should really pay. Now, they just listed it four days ago. So are they going to be down to just accept our lowball offer of 60 grand right now? Probably not, right? The, the odds are really good that they're probably going to decline the offer. But this is the thing, man. You got to consider like what we're doing trying to build you this portfolio kind of like fishing we're just we're just putting lines in the water right now like four days in i think it's overpriced i don't necessarily think they're going to get somebody to come in and pay 82. so you know maybe we submit our sixty thousand dollar offer they tell us no right now but you know maybe in a month they come back to us two months they come back to us right you know maybe not maybe it sells for a higher price cool whatever man you know we didn't get that deal. That's okay. You know, that's what we're doing, though, right? We're fishing. We're putting lines in the water, right, to see who bites, right? You know, it's not like we could just find super awesome deals, do absolutely no work, and then, you know, just the money starts rolling in, right? We got to do some work here, and a lot of that work involves, you know, putting in lowball offers and waiting people out, right? Being patient, being consistent. I've done some of my best deals uh, you know, in my personal portfolio where I gave an offer to a seller, seller laughed at me, told me to fuck myself, but you know, my offers are hard, man, they're cash, no fucking questions asked, and you know, they say, fuck you, I'm not taking that offer, but then like, six months down the road, you talk to them again, you know, things have changed in their life, they need you, right? So I say 60 G's, we throw that offer out there, I highly, uh, highly anticipate it getting declined right now, but you know, Things could change because, you know, four days into the listing, they're pretty confident in their price. But 64 days into the listing, they might not be. So if we pick it up for 60 Gs, we bring in 1350 in rent, assuming those tenants are still there. Uh, I anticipate us spending approximately 669 on average running this sucker, leaving y'all with a NOI of 681 there, right? Same thing, man. Let's no cash offers here, dude. Let's finance right off the rip, right? Let's keep your cash in your pocket right now. You only need fifteen grand to get into this if we get it for that price. So after it all shakes out, dude, you guys will be at thirty-nine percent cash on cash return. And this one, we're closer to Metro Health, right? We're a lot closer. We're only about twenty-five streets away from the actual campus, right? As opposed to the previous property, which is another fifty streets away. So that is something I really, really like. And then same thing applies up north, right? We got the good stuff. Iowa City, Tremont, Gordon Square. To the west, first we're gonna run into our other property, but then after that, when we continue west, past West One Seventeenth, it turns into Lakewood, which is an incredibly nice neighborhood. Then to the west of that. You you got like Rocky River, all kinds of good stuff, right? So I think this one will make some sense too, but I think it's going to be a low ball offer and I don't necessarily see anything shaking out up front right now. Now, Kale Dave, brothers, uh, you guys know the drill, but uh, I got to just real quick uh, take everybody else who's watching this show, bring you all back to HoltonWise.com, tell you to click the property search for sale tab. Two ways to buy properties from us. First way is going to be the investment properties for sale show okay you guys you click this you subscribe to our daily uh email list we are going to send you properties we're selling complete with video tours right drone footage everything you need to make a buying decision come into your inbox every day 1 p.m eastern standard time we are the number one seller of rental real estate in cleveland second way to buy it's what dave and kale do all right the mls search and analysis show I bring properties to you from other sources than myself, my company. We're the number one seller, but we ain't the only seller, man. We got over 5,000 realtors in the area. You got for sale by owners. You got bank tapes. You got wholesalers. You got all of it, right? Uh, we are just going to work for you and you alone, okay? We are paid by you and you alone. We are not trying to do win-win deals uh, when we're doing this show. We are trying to extract as much money from those sellers as humanly possible and put it in your pocket. Uh, Dave and Kale, they do the big packages, which I really like, which I think is smart. Okay. 10 property package because we could do them like one video one property things of that nature but this is the smartest way to buy guys because we're trying to build portfolios and like i said we're kind of fishing man we're putting lines in the water these deals all are not going to pan out right we got to kind of wait people out so like you know 
it's not so much as like, yeah, I want to invest in real estate. You reach out to me and then two days later, I give you this awesome property. Boom. Now you're a real estate investor, right? There's going to take some time, some work, putting in some offers, renegotiating. People are going to come back to us, right? So you kind of need to get set up to be with me uh, for the long term, right? You know, I don't know if I'm your girlfriend as much as your wife, right? Like, we got to kind of set this up for the long haul here. And this, this package, the 10 property package, it allows us to do that, go back and forth. We could do things like target the West 52nd property with a low ball offer. Because, you know, me and you guys, Dave, Kale, we'll still be working together, building your portfolio two, three, four, five, six months from now, right? These things take time. So that is why I like that package. And then... uh Last thing, and I'll let everyone get out of here, is right here. You can click here, and you guys can get my MLS access, my broker access, right? We got all kinds of goodies in here, right? Seller finance deals. Anybody who puts a property on the MLS that's down to do seller financing, you will get my access to it. You get it before Zillow, before Realtor.com, and it's already pre-sorted. And you guys... Seller finance. If you're out there trying to sell their finance, you want the seller finance deals, boom. Any time one hits the market, the moment it hits the market, you know the same time any other broker knows. So you can make moves on seller finance deals. We got the same thing for flip deals. And then we break it out into our normal rentals uh, separated by risk class per the ultimate guide to grading Cleveland neighborhoods in addition to single families, small multifamilies, and the large stuff, right? So we got all kinds of goodies for y'all. And then... You guys want to buy the stuff, do the stuff, use our services, manage on your own, manage with another PM company, or have us manage everything top to bottom. We could do that. We even got insurance, and we got title resources for y'all. So that's what we do. As always, I'm James Wise of Holton Wise, and this is Real Estate Investing Made Easy. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Based in Indianapolis, Indiana, FS Houses is the premier investment property brokerage with an in-house property management department that can take care of all those unwanted landlord headaches, FS Houses can offer you the complete turnkey solution as well as wholesale properties offered to you at a discounted rate. With a network of thousands of active investors, wholesalers, and brokers, FS Houses can help you sell your property for top dollar on the open market or in a hurry to motivated investors seeking distressed real estate. Visit FSHouses.com or call 317-492-9025 for more information on the Indianapolis, Indiana real estate. Rent Tech Direct provides you with an easy to use yet robust platform for managing your properties, complete with its built-in reporting and accounting system that can be customized to fit your business. You can manage work orders and even accept them online from your tenants. You can also share work order details with tenants or owners if you wish. With Rent Tech Direct, you'll also fill your vacancies faster than ever with the built-in marketing tools. Just enter the details of your property and Rent Tech will automatically provide you with a professional online website as well as syndicate them to popular websites such as Zillow, Trulia, and Apartments.com to get your listing maximum exposure so it's rented fast. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on our latest content, including video tours and analysis of investment properties that are available for sale, real estate investment education, and our most interesting encounters with tenants from hell. Holton Wise, real estate investing made easy.